Chris, how are you doing? Um, I've had a couple of questions about how I um, process some of the sounds that I record um, so that they're clear when I do a clip. So I just thought I'd go through that. Um, here's last night's um, recording. So we're at midnight. Now I know we've got something coming up. So and it's it's not a bad little set of calls. So we'll go through that one. So we'll just tab through. Uh, let's come on. Let's tab through. Uh, here we go. So okay. So there's a set of calls. Those nice staple shapes. Um, so we'll give them a play. So that's a wee bit quiet. So what I'll do is I'll cut that out and I'll start a new file and we'll process it in there. So we'll go back and then I'll highlight them with a little bit of lead in time. So there's our calls. There is actually a quieter one beyond that, but we won't worry about that now. Go to the clipboard and then we'll create a new one. And then we'll paste off the clipboard. Sorry if you can hear my kids in the background. Right, so then what we'll do, because we've got the whole clip, we'll get the clip fitted to the screen. And we've got quite a lot of noise at the bottom here. So what I'll do here is I will try and eliminate that with a high pass filter. So we're looking at that. There's nothing on those oyster catcher calls below about 1400, 1500. So I'll put a high pass filter on for about 1200 and uh, hopefully gets rid of some of that noise below. Yeah, there, that looks a load better. So then what I'll do is I will select a few seconds of silence. Uh, that's our background kind of noise level and um, I will just apply some noise reduction. So we get we go to effect noise reduction and get noise profile. And we go control A and that selects the whole thing. And we go effect, we go noise reduction, and we go apply. So there we go. That that's a much clearer looking sonogram now. So you can see there's a lot less background noise. But I think one of the issues we'll have, and one of the issues many people have had, is their recordings are very quiet. So then you go to effect, and you want to make this a bit louder, amplify. So I reckon this is quite a good one. So I reckon we'll go for about 15 decibels of amplification. If you're louder, if you're really clear, then 10. Um, if it's over 20, you might make a bit of a mess of it. So this is going to enjoy, introduce some grain back in. And you can see that's a lot louder, but it's got the the grain in the background so that's we'll play that you can hear the fuzz that's a nice clear oyster catcher call and really typical on the sonogram you know you, you wouldn't confuse that with the song thrush which you might do at dawn or dusk so we'll pause that Oh, it stopped itself. And then what I'll do is I'll just, again, try and reapply some noise reduction. So we'll go effect and noise reduction. Get a noise profile. So again, we've just selected a couple of seconds of silence. There we go. Control A, effect, and just apply that. Okay. So then... The only problem here is because we've applied it twice, this might sound a bit weird. So you need to have a bit of a play with how you do this. But here we go, nice and quiet. And then you've got the two birds calling. Here. So that call still sounds pretty good, but the other ones will sound a bit messy. Um, so it's probably over-processed this. And if you change the order in which you do stuff, then that can make a real difference. Um, so what you might want to do is amplify first and then apply one le one round of noise reduction. Um, but whatever suits your call best. All right. Cheers.